Brazil's new light-duty vehicle emission standards introduce a combined non-methane organic gas plus nitrogen oxides metric that better reflects the total organic gases emitted by combustion engines. This chart shows that for passenger vehicles, Brazil's limits generally compare well with international best practices in both the L7 phase, which takes effect January 1st, 2022, and the L8 phase, which will come into force from 2025 to 2031. However, as this chart shows, it's quite different for light commercial vehicles, which are allowed to emit more organic gases and NOx than passenger vehicles. Brazil's standards are much less stringent than U.S. Tier 3 standards, particularly for diesel vehicles in the L7 phase, where meeting the 320 milligrams per kilometer limit wouldn't require aftertreatment. So as it stands now, light commercial vehicles in Brazil, which includes SUVs and pickup trucks used mostly for passenger transport, will be allowed to pollute significantly more than passenger vehicles, and more than they would be in the United States, where the best available control technologies are widely commercialized.